Steve here from Show Homes Online and we're at Miller's Reach by Taylor Wimpy Homes and that is in Stone in Staffordshire. Now I want to take a look at this house type here. This is the three bedroom Aldenham by Taylor Wimpy. It's a beautiful house. I think it's one of my personal favourite Taylor Wimpy house designs. Such a compact three bedroom house. A lot is in that house. Without further ado let's go and take a look. Welcome to the Aldenham by Taylor Wimpy yeah. and we're at Miller's Reach we in are. Stone in Staffordshire. Now, as you know, the Aldenham is a favourite of mine because it, it derives from an original McLean Homes house type mm. um, called the Brook Stroke Sherwood. Um, great design and they've fiddled around with it a bit and um, it's nice to be back in one. It's a great three bedroom house this is good isn't it yeah so we've got a long hall other side of this wall is the garage yeah I think you get a lot for a free bed here yeah? and we're actually the opposite to plan again so yeah. if we start in here which is the dining room yeah now this is it a free bedroom house with a garage and a dining room separate dining room I know. Quite a luxury Dimensions in here, 3 metres 10 by 2 metres 62. I think originally the kitchen, the dining room, the lounge used to be at the front and the dining room at the back. Mm. Very, very nice. Again, a very nicely staged home as well. We've got a really good window on the front of that as well, look. I will open this door for you, Steve, so it's the... Uh, WC. Yep, so we've got the WC. That's quite a deep one, really. That goes right back, that does. Yeah. Um, well, again, it's two meters six. Yeah. Same as the dining room. That little it? radiator here, good size. I think if there's an alarm box there. You know, you could, if you wanted to, you could have your coats hanging yeah. here. You could have your Furniture. wellies lined up, couldn't yeah. you? So that they're not in the hallway. Yeah, it's very good. Your washing basket and things. Okay. So this is the lounge then at the rear. Lounge is 4 metres 32 by 3 metres 18. Lovely set of French doors yeah. there that look out onto the garden. Some additional windows as well on them. I mean, it's practically that whole wall, isn't it? Yeah. With windows. Yes, I do. I'm a fan of these little small windows that you could, they're locked actually. But if you just want to open the windows, have a little bit of fresh air, rather than have to have the French doors wide open, particularly in the winter, you can just open the little small windows, can't you? Yeah. Very nice. So they've got two sofas, quite a large TV unit there, there's plenty of space. Lovely picture there on the wall, I do like that very what much. A, um, a bank of sockets there, so we've got phone, we've got TV, um, I think that's a, an isolator for maybe an outside light. One thing I do like is the traditional doors, Taylor yeah. Wimpy beveled glass yeah. doors. I don't know whether we see them because obviously they're We haven't seen them for a while no. but they're in both of the two show homes yeah. here actually and I do like them. They maximise the light and they drag yeah. it through into the hallway and whatever so it just gives you that sense of space doesn't it? Even, look, even the kitchen's got a glass door. How nice is that? So separate kitchen so well when I say separate I mean contained. 
It's yeah. not joined to the dining room. I mean, you could have a little breakfast area here if you wanted. There is room for that. Kitchen, three meters exactly by two meters 96. So yeah, it's almost nice. a square. Right, let's have a look what we've got. Lots of eye line cupboards. I like the finish. So there's your oven. Gas hob there, four burners. Oh, okay. So there's your compact, integrated yeah. washer dryer. I'm not sure what's included. You'd need to ask the sales negotiator. So this is your dishwasher. Oh, slimline dishwasher. Yeah. So much more efficient use of space. I like that. Beautiful work surface, actually. One and a half bowl sink. There's your window to the rear garden. Okay. And then fridge and freezer there on the end. So plenty of cupboard space. I mean, you could even have a few more... I can, you know, line cupboards there as, if you as I was saying, it's got a very traditional layout as well, yeah, which is really definitely. nice. And you've got a door outside as well. Yeah, so you want to take your laundry and peg it out on the washing line. Yeah. And also that will take you back to the front of the house as well, won't it? So if you've got your bins and whatever, that's how you would deal with that. But yes, there is space for a small table if you wanted one. I like that. It's kind of nice, isn't it? So the stairs are side on in this house which is quite nice they go up through the middle of the house yeah okay then right so i think if we start at the rear and then work our way work our way forwards so we've got bedroom two Men's bedroom what's the size ever well i'm just checking 3 meters 82 by 2 meters 71. So what do we know about um, about Stone? It's a market town, isn't it? Yes. It's on the A34, so it isn't too far away from Stoke-on-Trent, or it's not too far away from Stafford or the motorway. Great, got a lovely high street, it's got a Morrison's, and just over there you can just see it peeking through, you've got an Aldi. You can't go close. I mean, Yes, it has got a lovely little town centre, hasn't yeah. it? Lots of good shops. And a lovely canal running through it as yeah. well. I Beautiful got, place. I love that wallpaper with the wellies. We've seen that before. Ever so nice, isn't it? And the cushions to match. Okay, so across the landing we've got bedroom three. It's worth mentioning as well, this house does have an integral garage as well. Yeah. Oh, see, you pack, pack a lot into this three bed. So a nice double bedroom. Two metres 99 by four metres... Uh, sorry, two metres 42. It's got a built-in wardrobe. wardrobe, yeah. It's just, just a little addition, isn't it? It's a big window, isn't it? In yeah, here? a lot of the I've noticed a lot of the houses Lovely. in here have big windows. Very, very light. And a good size landing actually in this house. So there's a cupboard yeah. on the landing. Could be your airing cupboard. And then you've got bedroom one. So in bedroom one we've got a double wardrobe there and then we've got, uh, I think that's the same wardrobe but it is. Yeah, it's, yeah. The, it's the third door for the wardrobe. Yes, the third door. Dimensions, 4 metres 38 by 3 metres 17 yeah. in here. Again another good window. I'd say that's a king size bed Yeah. but you've got plenty of room if you wanted a super king size bed, you could fit a much bigger bed in. Plenty of room either side of the bed. You could put your TV on here because you've got your sockets and what yeah. have you there. Additional furniture. I suppose you've got room at the side of the bed. Yeah, there's you could a, you know, yeah, there is. Yeah, and it's got an ensuite. So let's have a look in the ensuite. Lovely little angle on that ensuite there. Just doesn't neatly, neatly snuck into there. But you've got a single shower with a um, shower unit there. Um, and that's a good size. Um, yeah, it's spacious, it's got a little window in it, but it's, it's not bad at all, is it? What a great house type. I, mean, I love, I love the Alderman. Um, lovely house type. Yes. And this is one of the most popular free beds of um, Taylor Wimpy. Yeah. Uh, I'll, you'll find the Alderman on a lot of sites, so, you know, not just here. Yeah, but we're very interested to know what you think of this house type. Please, uh, please comment in the box down below. 
I will put all the details, all the information, all the spec, everything you need to know about this house and this development in the description box, so don't forget to check it out down there. There will also be a link to Taylor Wimpy's main website, so if, you, if you've got any further questions or you want to come and take a look, you just click on that and it will take you straight through. And uh, leave us a review on our Facebook page, that would be nice. Mm. But we will catch you on our next video. Thanks for watching. Thank you.